going on, y'all? What is up? What is up? The Fat Boy Gamer, a.k.a. Straight Up Cooking, whatever the heck you want to call me. But anyways, y'all, what's going on? I'm ready to bring you guys an ice cream review today because my baby came home and surprised me with this uh, new theater bowl ice cream by the name of, um, I mean, from Baskin Robbins, what I'm trying to say here. And I know a lot of you guys have been wanting to check out my uh, food reviews for a long time. And make sure you guys check out my past videos as well. If you guys don't want to miss out, just make sure you guys comment, rate, subscribe, and all that. And today, we have this popcorn right here, and it's um, a flavored ice cream with buttered flavored, uh, with uh, crisp pieces into it, with um, popcorn into it as well, and it has a, a salted caramel taste to it. And as you guys can see right here, um, as you guys, I got the bowl right here with the waffle cone going around it, and I wanted to try it out and do uh, a review of it as well. So if you guys have a Baskin Robbins in your area, make sure you guys go check it out to make sure they have it available. And um, let's see what we got going on here. And um, for the last past couple of months, we've been trying out salted caramel, you know, pies here and there from Edwards and, you know, other companies as well. So let's give it a try here and see what is going on because I got to hurry up and eat it because Miss Glam is a fan of popcorn and she's trying to say she don't want to eat none of this. And I know she's going to eat it if I leave it, you know, with her for about 15 minutes and come home and probably be gone. But anyways, y'all, we're going to try it out here. And it does have that theater popcorn taste. Like when you go in a the movie theater. And it has the popcorn taste into it. And it has the salted caramel. It's pretty, pretty good. I'm going to show you guys right here in this bowl again. Right here. All up in the camera. As you guys see. And then, uh, you can go to bathroomrobin.com to check out the flavors of what's all up into it. And the thing that we checked out when we was online, they didn't even add the whipped cream or the cherry on top. And this thing costs about five, like almost five dollars. So next time we go get another one, we'll tell them that they forgot to add the whipped cream and cherry on top. Because you know I love my cherries, y'all. So like I said, y'all has a salted caramel taste with the popcorn pieces into it. And there is popcorn in here. There's no popcorn in here? It's moving through the popcorn. It's got popcorn in it. Why can't they got popcorn in it? Flavored. Flavored popcorn? Yes. Oh, my bad, y'all. I'm talking about they popcorn in it. Good. That's the whole point. Well, anyways, y'all don't got popcorn in it. My bad. <laughs> but who gives a good? It's still a review. I'm sitting here reading the screen. Butter flavor. I don't care. It tastes like it got popcorn in it, but it's still good though, y'all. Shit. I think it would have been better if it had popcorn in it though. You don't think so? You think? This lamb over here bugging me, y'all, today. So, but anyways, y'all, y'all need to go check this out at Baskin Robbins. It's butter flavored popcorn, right here, bowl. All right, like it. Rate, comment, subscribe. Sorry for the mess up. Anyways, y'all, just still a review. Stuff and uh, maybe you want to just you know add your own pineapples to give it that you know real maybe upside down pineapple cake. You know, add it into this you know box cake right here that says pineapple. It doesn't say pineapple upside down cake. It's just a pineapple flavored cake right there. And um.